Hello parents and students. As we begin to transition the kindergarten through fourth grade classrooms to virtual learning, we wanted to provide you with some resources that would help you to navigate various applications such as Google Classroom. Let's start by opening the Google Classroom app. We can place two fingers on the screen and pull down in order to open up the search taskbar. Type classroom into the search bar and select classroom. Because this is our first time opening the app, it will require us to sign in using our Google account. Enter the provided username into the box and then click Next. It should look similar to the username currently displayed on the screen. Then enter your password and click Next. This will redirect you to your Google Classroom dashboard. There are two ways in which to join a class. The first is using a class code. If your teacher provided you with a class code, select the plus sign in the top right corner and enter the class code. Once you've typed in the class code, select Done, and you'll be redirected to the class page. We will discuss the layout of the class page in more detail in a moment. First, let's navigate back to the dashboard by clicking the three lines on the left-hand side and selecting Classes. The second way to join a class is by Teacher Invite. If you have already been invited, you will see the class listed and simply click Join. There are two tabs on Classroom that we can use to navigate, Stream and Classwork. Stream is what we're currently looking at. It is going to include all of the assignments and announcements that have been posted by the teacher. Assignments are indicated by the blue clipboard and can be accessed by clicking on the assignment name. After selecting the assignment, we will be redirected to the assignment page where we can see the due date, which is due tomorrow, the number of points for the assignment, the directions for completing the assignment, and the attached assignment. Additionally, at the bottom of the page, you will see the Your Work tab. When you select this tab, you will be able to find any edited and saved documents. You will be able to add attachments such as pictures and Google Docs, turn in the assignment, and directly contact your teacher via email. There are two additional ways in which we can access our assignments. By navigating back to the main classroom dashboard, we can click on Classwork. This will show all upcoming assignments. Or we can click on the three dashes on the left side and click on To Do, which will show us the assignments that are upcoming and the ones that we have already completed. In the next video, I will show you how to download the assignments, edit the assignments, and turn them in. Thank you.